Hey everybody, um, Thomas, Percy, and Sandy here. Hello. Hi. We don't actually count this as a, a TTAF episode, but since it is anyway, Justin said he has a mystery video for us to watch today. So let's get on with it. I think so. A hippie? Who are you calling a hippie? Percy? Ow! What was that for? Don't call me a hippie! Okay, sorry. Yeah, you better be sorry. Are you excited for a new day out of new school? I'm definitely excited, but I'm a little nervous still, too. We have home together and we have lunch at the same period, so that means we can eat together every day. Awesome. Thanks for being such a cool friend. You're amazing. Sam. 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 Thomas. Stop sipping diesel things for me. Oh, uh, you're right. And you sent for me because I got the six pack abs and everything. Okay, you you're good to go in. Uh -huh. uh, wait a second, young man. You're in violation of the school dress code. Excuse me? What? Did I stutter? Um, no. What's your name? Delroy. J. Roy? Delroy. It means the king. Oh, excuse me, your highness, but the school dress code clearly states that every male student must not have long hair. Hey, that's sexist. No but officer. How's that sexist? I can't cut my hair. Just because boy, my girls culture. have short hair. Long hair, young, that yeah, doesn't mean artist. boys have to have short hair. They can have any he's, hair he's they want. Day, Long, Jamaican. short, Long or job. no hair. Uh, you you're got a point. I mean, Trey's not even have me. hair. And we certainly but, do not cut okay. hair because it shows our I don't know, track. Sandy, do you have hair? Okay. Uh, I don't Something know. Listen, in my Rastiki. mouth, maybe? Ew. No in my nose? Ew! No, hair girl! Nose hair, girl. Percy, let's stay away from nose hairs, girl. Yeah, and look, we get a better view to view the video. And we get a better view what here. You, what are you doing? I'm hiding all my hair under this hat. Oh, good choice. Shh. Sorry, if they can't see my hair, Sorry. don't know how long it is. Shh. Sorry. How does it look? I said sorry, okay? I said sorry, okay, Jeez. You know the drill. Ooh, I get the video to myself. This Open is sweet. Not for long. Okay, you're good to go. Not for long, Thomas. All right. Okay. Good morning, uh, sir. Wait a minute. Yes, sir? You ain't fooling anybody, Ziggy Marley. Excuse what me? seems to be the problem? I know you're hiding those nappy dreadlocks underneath that hat. No, he's not. Yeah. Can't you just let us go? He told you yesterday that his hair is important to his culture. Rules are rules. Actually, this school's rules, rules are not rules. Clearly state that every boy's hair must be cut above the collar. Okay, do you, you have like a paper or a proof or something of it? What are you, what are you doing? Come on, have, a, have a seat, Sister Nancy. <laughs> Time for a trim. Please help. Stop. No! Go yeah, yeah, go, 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 go! That sick son of a gun. Why would he cut his hair? He's not a barber. I know, that's my point. And first of all, number one, where did he get those scissors from? One and two, why is he cutting his hair? He's not a barber. And number three, he's a police officer. Police officers can't be barbers. I think they can. Shut up, Sandy. I'm trying to make a point. You already are. You for your concern. Oh. And we appreciate the extra security this week. But extra security, we huh? You call that extra security? Protocol. Yes, Captain. Principal. Principal Evans. Okay, well, I, I've had a student come into my office. Thank you again for all your help. Okay. Bye. <laughs> it's still Roy. Delroy, the, the new boy. It, Delroy! Okay? Wait, that's the boy's I name? I think so. He's over there with the officer, Principal Adams. Stop! Stop! What on earth is 
going on here? Yeah, what on earth is happening? Oh, don't worry, ma'am. I got everything under control. Well, it doesn't look like that to me. He forced me to get a haircut. What? It's true. Yesterday, we, this officer told Delroy that he couldn't come in unless he cut his hair. But we explained to him that he can't cut his hair because it's a part of his culture. But he wouldn't just listen. Sergeant Green, explain yourself Wait, that's now. the officer's well, name? Say, the I think so. And it's because, you know, I am the best. So I'm just following the, I the best color in the world, no mean the brag. Hey, Percy, get out of the way. We can't see. I guess so. Sorry. I begged him, Principal Evans. I even told him how it's an important part of my culture. And we don't cut our hair because our strength lies in it. But he just wouldn't listen. Well, happy your strength no. fell off. Thanks for Sergeant Green. Long hair, short hair, or or no should hair. I say Sergeant I Terrible, who's I not an actual barber. Ha! <laughs> Got him! Okay, <laughs> both of you to go to back to Got him! <laughs> I will handle this. Hey, Thomas, are we supposed to be in school? No, it's a Sunday. Of all oh, the okay. Insensitive and idiotic things that I have idiotic? seen in my time I'll put as that as a, a stupid idiotic. Oh, please, it's just hair to grow back. I don't are think it will. Are you not aware of the trauma you caused that poor child while you forcibly cut his hair? Trauma? I think his parents Kill are going to sue the school district because of this. I think so. I think that's what it's gonna Sergeant happen. Green, and your services are no longer needed here. Oh, ho! You know, I just get wrecked, buddy. Get wrecked. Mm. Here's Could a taste of it. Mm, mm, mm. Yeah, school. take that. Played on the football team together, and they still remain very good friends. Wait, today. You guys play on the say. football oh, team? Say. You know, he and his family come over to my house for Thanksgiving every year. Wait, what? You're that close, huh? Are you actually I think I'm gonna serious? go upstairs and call my good friend back and let him know about this little incident today. Please, um, Principal Evans, um, I'll go quietly and we can just keep this between us. Uh, you don't have to No, 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 no. I think the good no. Captain Porter, the very highly decorated police chief of mango park police definitely needs to know oh and yeah he does to to need to know and call yes. him right Foolish now act. and tell him good day sergeant green oh dang dang bro you just got fired ha that's a savage you know see that's a savage right there dang 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 you just got savage bro thomas i think you're being more of a savage whatever that was a great video i know right my favorite part was when when he got fired mine's too all right kids so the moral of the story is don't cut hair until you're a licensed barber and don't get the scissors from the middle of a street. Actually, Sandy, I think he had those scissors on the entire time. And also, don't be a stupid sexist cop and stuff. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, if you guys want me and Percy to react to other videos, yes, we will. Anyways, I'll see you guys later. Bye!